The British Royal Navy has welcomed the fifth hunter-killer submarine, formerly named HMS Anson. BAE Systems unveiled the latest astute class boat in the Devonshire Dock Hall, the UK's gigantic submarine construction complex. The ceremony was small. Cliff Robson, managing director of BAE Systems, said only a handful of people were able to attend the ceremony because of the coronavirus pandemic. He said, We know these submarines are essential for the defense of the nation. Viewers may note that more than 1,700 people are involved in the astute program, which is delivering seven attack submarines to the Royal Navy. Earlier this year, HMS Audacious, the fourth boat in the class, left Barrow for her operational base at Her Majesty's Naval Base Clyde in Faslane. In this video, Defense Updates analyzes how powerful is Britain's latest astute class hunter-killer submarine, HMS Anson. Let's get started. This video is sponsored by the free-to-play military vehicle combat game War Thunder. We talk a lot about military vehicles on this channel, but what about trying them out for yourself? In War Thunder, you can choose from more than 1,200 playable vehicles from the 1930s to the 1990s and go to battle on more than 80 theaters of war. You can fly aircraft, helicopters, drive tanks, and command ships of all types and sizes, which have been carefully recreated from their real-world counterparts. It's available as a free download on PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One with cross-platform support, so grab your friends and give it a try. All viewers of Defense Updates that register using the link in the description below will also get a free premium tank, aircraft, or ship and three days of premium account time as a bonus. The Astute class is the latest class of nuclear-powered fleet submarines SSNs, in service with the Royal Navy. The class sets a new standard for the Royal Navy in terms of weapons load, communication facilities, and stealth. The boats are being constructed by BAE Systems Maritime Submarines at Barrow Inverness. Seven boats will be constructed. The first of class, Astute, was launched by Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, in 2007, commissioned in 2010, and declared fully operational in May 2014. The Astute class is the replacement for the Trafalgar class fleet submarines in Royal Navy service. The Astute class is the largest and most advanced attack submarines ever built for the Royal Navy. The class sets a new standard for the Royal Navy in terms of weapons load, communication facilities, and stealth. The Astute class leads the way with many technological firsts and is the quietest ever made. HMS Anson is 97 meters long and displaces 7,400 tons. The submarine is due to be launched into the water in Barrow early next year, ahead of leaving for sea trials in 2022. The boats of the Astute class are powered by a Rolls-Royce PWR2 Core H, a pressurized water reactor, and fitted with a pump jet propulsor. The PWR-2 reactor was developed for the Vanguard-class ballistic missile submarines and has a 25-year lifespan without the need for refueling. Also, the Astute-class submarines can manufacture their own oxygen and fresh water from the ocean, meaning they are able to travel the world without surfacing. Like all Royal Navy submarines, the bridge fin in the Astute-class boats is specially reinforced to allow surfacing through ice caps. These submarines can also be fitted with a dry deck shelter, which allows special forces, for example SBS, to deploy whilst the submarine is submerged. It's operated by a crew of 98. More than 39,000 acoustic tiles mask the vessel's sonar signature, giving the Astute class improved acoustic qualities over any other submarine previously operated by the Royal Navy. HMS Anson is equipped with Thales Sonar 2076, Atlas DESO 25 Echo Sounder, two Thales CM010 Optronic Mast, as well as Raytheon successor IFF. Sonar 2076 is an integrated, passive, active search and attack sonar suite with bow, intercept, flank, and towed arrays. Its manufacturer claims that 
2076 is the world's best sonar system. It's said to have 13,000 hydrophones, many times the number fitted in previous Royal Navy systems, and more than any other submarine sonar in the world. A key development is the use of high performance and easily upgradable commercial off the shelf COTS processing systems, allowing the introduction of much more sophisticated algorithms compared to earlier sonars. The processing power of the system is said to be equivalent to 60,000 home PCs. HMS Anson is equipped with Astute Combat Management System ACMS. ACMS receives data from the sonars and other sensors and through advanced algorithms and data handling, displays real-time images on the command consoles. HMS Anson has six 21-inch torpedo tubes with stowage for up to 38 weapons. The Astute class carries both Tomahawk land attack cruise missiles TLAM, and Spearfish heavyweight torpedoes. The Tomahawk land attack missiles is a long-range, all-weather, jet-powered subsonic cruise missile. It's in service since 1983 and the missile has been used on several occasions. The missile has a speed of about 550 miles per hour or 890 kilometers per hour and a maximum range of 2,500 kilometers or 1,550 miles. It's guided by GPS and INS and some variants also have active radar homing. The Block 4 variant includes a two-way satellite link that allows reprogramming of the missile in flight and transmission of battle damage indication BDI imagery. Royal Navy started receiving this variant in April 2008. The Spearfish torpedo is the heavy torpedo used by the submarines of the Royal Navy. It can be guided by wire or by autonomous active or passive sonar and provides both anti-submarine warfare ASW, and anti-surface ship warfare ASUW, capability. Spearfish development began in the 1970s, with production starting in 1988 and deployment in 1992. By 2004, they had completely replaced the older Tigerfish torpedo. It's said to be one of the most advanced torpedoes in the world and also the fastest long-range torpedo ever produced. It has a 300 kilogram or 660 pound warhead, maximum speed of 148 kilometers per hour or 92 miles per hour, and a range of 54 kilometers or 33 miles. HMS Anson will certainly be an important addition to the Royal Navy fleet. The sub is one of the most deadly ones in the world since it carries the fastest long-range heavyweight torpedo, Spearfish, and also has one of the most potent sonars. This will enable the submarine to cripple very large opponents and enable it to carry out both deterrent as well as offensive missions. Viewers may note that work is also well underway in Barrow on astute boats 6 and 7. When all these seven operate together, the British military planners will have great flexibility. It remains to be seen if the astute program is able to deliver in the specified time. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos like this. Hit the like button if you find the video interesting and kindly provide your feedback in the comment section. This will help us improve.